90 Day Fiancé. The Other Way had one of the best plot twists in recent TV history. The TLC reality show drew fans for a loop when Sumit revealed he was secretly married this whole time Jenny was a mistress. In a recent episode, Jenny told a tale of what happened when Sumit's father-in-law found them and confronted her. She met his wife and his mother and told a somewhat harrowing tale of an encounter in her apartment. With Sumit gone, she is living alone in India, paralyzed with fear. In the Monday, September 23rd episode, Suma told his side of the story. Yes, I lied a lot to everyone, Sumit admitted. I did a lot of things wrong. As he told it, he was dating Jenny when his parents entered him in an arranged marriage. He said he wanted to tell Jenny, but was so worried she'd leave him. After the truth came out, Sumit said he was held in his parents' home for five days and they have forbidden him to contact Jenny. 90 Day producers asked Sumit's family and in-laws to take part in the series and they declined. Now they know that I love Jenny, Sumit said. Sumit was able to go see his friend and the cameras followed. Sumit said he wants to get separated from his wife and live with Jenny, but he's worried that his in-laws will go to the police with false claims and get everybody tied up in charges. Still, he said he'd rather be in jail than in the marriage. I want to be with Jenny. It's my right to be happy, Sumit said. Jehoon and Devan in South Korea, Devan got pretty drunk with Jehoon's friends and worked up the courage to ask them to shed more light on his past crimes. Jehoon sold stolen phones in China. This is an international crime, a worry Devan said. Despite her worries about this past and admitting she doesn't really know him that well, she went forward with the marriage and legally wed Jehoon in South Korea. It just feels like I turned in homework, Devan said about the wedding. Laura and Aladdin the three-day wedding continued in Tunisia with Liam, Laura's son, skipping yet another day of festivities. He has diarrhea, just relax, man, Laura told Aladdin about Liam's continued absence. After saying Liam is upset about the marriage, Aladdin decided he needed to make an effort with Liam and invited him to the baths. At the baths, Liam told Aladdin he is weary of him and the marriage. Aladdin said he just wants Laura to be happy and they want to have a family of their own. Aladdin is near 30. Laura is in her 50s, and a doctor told them it was possible for her to have another child. She's not having another kid. She's too old and it's dangerous for her, Liam protested. I draw the line at my mother having another child. Liam told Aladdin if they have a child, he's done with both of them, because then she wouldn't be able to fully support him. Corey and Evelyn Corey was still in the United States after the death of his father and found it hard to leave his mother again. I'm sorry I have to go, he cried. But his mom told him to go live his life and she'll be fine. Back in Ecuador, Evelyn actually showed up to pick him up from the airport. She said she missed him a lot and it felt like he was gone for a year. Despite all this, she doesn't want to get married. It's just not one of my dreams, she said. But marriage is necessary if they want to live together in a country. Back at home, Evelyn said she blocked her ex on all platforms while Corey was away. Did they have a fight? No, she said they haven't spoken. I want us to be okay, she said.